Hi guys, Mini Moon Cat here, and today I'm going to be doing a quick, like, three, four minute review on this Lego set. So this Lego set is this Infinity War, part of Infinity War set, and is the little escape pod um, from the Guardians of the Galaxy ship. So what you can do is you can take the roof off and open the two side bits, and we have four. Uh, rocket and Groot. So we'll look at this bit in a minute and first let's look at the ship. So the ship, really simple build actually, it only took me about 10 15 minutes. That falls down, that folds up, where it comes off. We have a little connector on the back so it connects to the big ship if you get that set as well. Uh, a few stickers, not that many. Uh, interesting shape actually. Um, and fits three minifigures in. Um, and yeah, so that's good. And it has two little guns on the top, they're stud shooters that shoot the little studs. So yeah, that is a little ship. Next we've got the other little build, which is the place where Thor makes his axe slash hammer. Um, this thing spins around from the back, but there's a little thing that you can twist. Also that moves up and down as well. It's got a couple stickers on it on the insides. Comes with a power stone in this set, for the purple ones. And Thor's weapon is in there as well. And what happens basically is you push the little drawer through and it reveals Thor's weapon. So that's really cool. Um, yeah, so it's just a little slide thing and you push it. Yeah, it's really easy. A really simple build. Now the, the figures, we've got Groot. Um, the, these guys, the figures' weapons don't fit in the spaceship at all. Apart from Rocket's weapon, which is a little gun. So here's Groot. He has this little branch. Really cool. We've got four, and you can use his axe. He also has another face with lightning eyes. There's four, and he can have some lightning um, things as well. And Rocket, and he has his little gun. It's really small. He's got short little legs. Uh, the head piece is really cool. The tail, you can put the tail down, but you can't stand up properly. It's, it's taller than him, basically. So that's really cool. Uh, Rocket is I, really detailed, just like Groot. Um, yeah, and none of them have printing on their legs. So, yeah, so really easy to put them back in uh, I'll be doing the 80 quid set like later so yeah so rocket just you can stand in that with his weapon in the front it's hard to put rocket in all right there we go so you can stand rocket up and then you can put that in and take off group's weapon you can sit Groot in, you can put the roof on, and then a little bit, oh, and that took Thor's hand with him, for some reason. Right, and Thor, uh, just is one of those things that go in between the legs, so you like slide him in, and he sits there. He's not as stable though, he can move around a bit in it. Yeah, Thor can't really sit still. It would be better if he had the same sort of way that Groot is sat down as well. So yeah, all three minifigures fit in there. Then you can have their weapons on the ground separately there. Or something. And then we've got the other build with the power stone. And yeah, it, it, you come with three spare power stones, and they're really small. And yeah, so 
Well, that's this simple build. Uh, it took me about 15, 10, 15 minutes, basically. Uh, yeah, and I think it's worth it to get four Groot and Rocket in a really cheap set. So, yeah, this was 20 quid. Um, next one I'll be doing is the 80 quid Endgame Compound set. Comes with Thanos, which is really cool. So, see you guys then. Yeah. Bye.